Yeah. All right, guys. If the camera will focus, we are. We got a big video planned, actually. So, Joseph's dad. He is getting surgery done this morning. Uh, all in all, we're taking Julius hunting to kill his first deer, and I'm about 98.9.6 percent positive that we're gonna kill one because we're going to a stand. I haven't seen. Well, I haven't been there and not seen a deer all year. Every time I've went, I've seen a nice buck. So hopefully, as this car comes by. Hopefully we'll kill one. I'm pretty dang sure we are. Uh, it is a rainy, rainy, nasty, ugly day outside, but we're gonna make the best of it. And we're gonna go kill a deer. So we are currently on the way to go get Julius. I'm driving down his driveway now. His dad's not here. His dad's already at the hospital, and I'm not sure what time he's going into surgery. I don't think it's nothing big. It's something to do with his knee, so hopefully everything goes well with that, and They'll both have stories to tell each other whenever he gets back from the hospital. Uh, Julius has never killed a deer. I'm pretty sure he hasn't. So we're going to take him to go get his first deer. And I think we'll have, we have a pretty good shot at being a nice buck. Hey boss man. Long time no see. You ready to go kill a deer? Yeah. So, here's the big question. How many do you want to shoot tonight? <laughs> I don't care. I might shoot one if I have the opportunity to with the pistol. And then I think we're gonna try to get you a buck. Nice. It sounds like a good deal if you ask me. All right guys, so we are currently got everything packed up here. Let me actually show you guys. We got camo, my hunting bag, Julius's book bag full of his stuff, rifle, laptop, hats, pistols, knives, camera gear, and extra boots. So we are good to go. We are gonna head to Julius's house to get him some, uh, what are those things called? Coveralls. Coveralls from his house and then we're gonna be on the way to the deer club, but we actually gotta stop at Walmart to get his hunting tags so he can uh, go hunting. So, should be an exciting time. Lots of stuff we gotta get accomplished before we can go hunting, and it is, it's 11.25 on my toaster clock. <laughs> so, we're gonna get to moving. We gotta get down there before one o'clock, and uh, wish us luck. We are currently getting gas. Uh, my dad just called me, and he told me what happened yesterday, and, you guys are gonna wanna hear this. It's about the poacher thing, uh, the stand that actually got the camera stolen, the stand that someone actually shot a deer out of. He caught somebody there. And I kinda wish he filmed it, cause I know a lot of you guys aren't gonna believe this, but Julius, you heard him, right? Mm -hmm. Kinda crazy shit, ain't it? Yeah. He said uh, he blocked a man, jumped out with his pistol and everything. One of them got out, he uh, blocked the other one. Anyway, we'll go into detail once we get there. Uh, I'm probably gonna drive over there and explain it a little bit more and then we'll head to the deer stand and get to hunting. We are about 30 minutes out, it is 12.50. We should be there pretty soon. Like my dad's over here at the store. Clubhouse is right here. Now, nobody's down here this week because everybody went on a big quail hunting trip and uh, me and my dad missed it. And that's why we decided to come down here and shoot some damn deer. Door's open, that's weird. Julius, you haven't been in the clubhouse in a while, have you? No. Come on, let's go show you it. So. We got some new signs, no trespassing. Warning, due to the price of increase on ammo, do not expect warning shots. We got we got some new signs. Our room's kind of the same, and it's a mess, yeah. Picture board's the same, but we got new couches. Yeah, look at them. And then, we're also getting a new TV. One of the dudes, are, uh, Joe's bringing it down, so that'll be nice. And then a guest room, as always. I don't know if we're staying the night yet, but if we do, it should be fun. We are. We got a lot of stuff planned. Uh, I'm thinking got instead new of stairs. Yeah, new Damn stairs because right. my dad broke the other ones. How? I don't know. <laughs> but oh, um, and what? You got enough truck cameras? The camera tree. Yeah, let's go take a look at that. So my dad got bored, and uh, you think? <laughs> he took all of our broken cameras and made a Christmas tree. Uh, okay. Yeah. These are all the damn broken cameras we have. And we threw a bunch of them away, but we still have a ton. Is there another backside? Oh, that's most of them. All the guys are saying that they're gonna add to it, and they all got five or six. Don't fall! Oh, oh, nice. But yeah, skin and shed's basically the same, but we got a grill and a smoker locked up over there now, so that's nice. So we're about to pull out, but here comes my dad. We'll talk to him before we go. Any luck this morning hunting? Uh, we're about to head over there where you saw those guys at. 
You're coming? All right. So my dad is actually coming. He said he's gonna put out another trail camera. We had a trail camera out to catch people driving in there. And I shit you not, we took it out last week. <laughs> and that had to be the worst idea ever. My dad was worried about it getting stolen because he hit it like on the ground, right? Wait. But he didn't hit it or hide it well enough. And so after about a week, he, he said he's gonna take it out. But now it's, we're kind of regretting it. I'm ready to hear it. What's the story behind all of this? You didn't tell me much on the phone. Uh, hey, Julius. Hey. I was coming from that way and they This were, way? Yeah. And uh, a little Toyota car had already got out on the highway in a little gray, some kind of Dodge, something. Uh, he was trying to back up this hill. And he was having trouble getting up it. And anyway, so I, she was already out on the highway. Uh -huh. I pulled in behind him. But he, You're in front of him? Yeah, he didn't see me. I had to blow the horn to keep him from running into me. <laughs> so, so what'd you do? I told him, I said, what you doing in here? And uh, he, he said, he didn't really say anything. And I said, man, I said, you can't be in here like that. I said, we got stuff in here that got stolen recently. He said, you can look in the back. I hadn't stolen anything. And I, I figured out by that point in time that he was just somebody parking. And uh, anyway, they headed on up the road. I let him out. Oh, uh, you putting that camera out to catch more people, or are you putting it on there to, for deer? Next week, I'm gonna put a gate right there. You're gonna put a gate here? Yeah. That sounds like a good idea. Used to, you couldn't tell it was a trail, but now, yeah, yeah. it needs a gate on it. Yeah. All right, guys, I got the keys to the gate, and I got a range fighter just in case. Uh, I let a buck go last week. He was definitely a. Looking back, I should have shot him. It would made a great video. But if one comes out far that distance this week, Jules, how do you feel about shooting a deer at like 400 yards? Not. why not so I think we're actually gonna go ahead and go into the woods it's only 125 right now so I mean we got we don't we have another hour to kill but we ain't got nothing better to do so why not sneak in there right now finish our lunch and uh, it'll be about that time so we have a mess to sort through and get everything together but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get ready and get my hunting stuff on I think it's going to be a great hunt and I'm really looking forward to it so oh and by the way you're not even pointing the camera at me just be a better cameraman okay I'm, okay I'm I'm not a youtuber so there's a bunch of big bucks actually coming into the stand and my dad was looked through the card we didn't look through it but he said a bunch of new bucks a bunch of big bucks we're shooting one tonight. I'll give you that. I'll tell you that right now. We're gonna shoot a deer. We are currently walking in. We're gonna be hunting what we call the big stand. It is a damn house on power poles. <laughs> Ain't, I'm not lying, am I, Julius? It's huge. So, we got the snacks, AKA lunch. We're headed in early. It's like 1.30. Should be a good hunt. Guys, I can't tell you how excited I am because I'm not coming in here to watch some does. I'm coming in here to watch Julius blast away. <laughs> There's the stand, guys, right up there. We can see thousands of yards down the power line. So we should see some deer no matter what. We are basically set in. I'm running the tripod today instead of my camera arm. So uh, that'll be interesting to see how that works. I'm about to eat lunch because I'm hungry. All right, Joe, sit down and see how you like that. Just practice aiming at stuff out there by the creek. The creek is 300 yards and the very back of the field is 400. Don't put your hand up there. Put that at the base of the stock, like at the back. No, like right back there. And then you, can, you should be able to get more steady. Like lay the butt end of the gun on your hand, like in a fist almost. That way the gun's just sitting there. See how steady you can get? Just you better get your ass up. Come look what's in the corn pile. Yep, turkeys. <laughs> That's a different group from, from before. Yeah. I'm going back to bed. No, you're not. Don't go back to bed. I need to have a lookout, man, dude. Mm -hmm. I'm looking over there. Bullshit. We got a deer. Do you want to shoot him? I can't see him for sure. He's about 1,300 yards. <laughs> about three foot above his head. Definitely a buck. I'm gonna get down and try to see what kind of buck that is.
Angeles, put your finger on the trigger, get really steady, put it on the spot, and slowly squeeze through. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Told you we won't have to track her if you put it where I wanted it. Give me five, dude. I can't hear it all. I me mean, neither. It blew my damn ears out. God. No tracking for us. Mm, that was loud. My ears are shattered. <laughs> Give me a fist, dude. Yes. No tracking. A plus on the shooting. <laughs> Alright, well we're going to stick in the stand and hope another deer comes in. And I might shoot one. If a doe comes in, I'm going to shoot it. Mm -hmm. If a buck comes in, I'm going to let him shoot it. So, we'll stick around and see what happens. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Can you not see where you're going? Nah. So, we're headed back to Monty. That was a good hunt. It was fun. Kind of went, it didn't go as good as I expected it to. I was expecting to get a buck for him but that didn't seem to work out we waited made sure no buck was gonna come in after that doe did never came in so we decided to go ahead and take that doe <laughs> why couldn't I have been videoing oh that God. he just scared the shit out of us oh, I'm glad Julius was on that side <laughs> a good hunting spot yeah we were just talking having a conversation Bigfoot here snatches Julius <laughs> You hear the shot? Yeah. Julius shot that 11 point. Yeah. <laughs> no. A doe came in and uh, we waited around hoping a buck would be coming in behind her but never did. You can you hear about a pop. Yeah, you heard the pop? Yeah, yeah she, she, I told Julius where to put it. He put it there. Well, you can tell it's starting to go. Pow! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Here you go, gate boy. You're the gate boy. Julius, how you feeling about your first deer? My ears hurt. Your ears hurt? <laughs> it wasn't that loud, was it? It was loud. It, it literally about blew me backwards. It freaking knocked off the uh, that piece of metal. Hey, you put the smack down on her, didn't you? Yeah, I said, if you shoot her right there, she's gonna drop. <laughs> oh yeah, get down there. Hmm. Lay the gun across, we'll get a picture for you. Uh, Here, back. <laughs> you just got blood all over yourself. <laughs> Uh, we can get pictures at the clubhouse. All right, so Julius just popped his first tag. All right, guys, we are pulling into the clubhouse. Deer is on the back. We're not sure if we want to give it to one of our friends or if we want to clean it and keep the meat. We don't have a cooler with us, which is straight stupid, but we'll figure out what we're going to do here in a second. Blood. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, I think you hit her good. You drag her over blood? here. You didn't get blood all over you, did you? Mm. I don't see blood everywhere. It's in your hair. Oh, God. Come here. We got a towel or something. Look at it in his hair. Ooh. <laughs> oh, that's funny. There. Oh, mm. God. Mm. oh my God. Mm. You got a towel? Come wet mm. that one. It's on your face, too. And the back of your head. Jesus. Where? Boy, we got a shower. Right here, there's more paper towels. Where's my phone? This would be funny for Snapchat. Funny. What? Funny. Hilarious. Mmm, that's great. Mm. Smells good too. Yeah. There's some on your neck right there. And I think... Oh, God. Jesus. <laughs> Looks like you took a shower. Oh, there's blood. <laughs> oh, no. oh, it's blood dripping everywhere. Well... <laughs> I would say this was successful. We we killed that doe. Uh, none of the bucks showed up like we were hoping. But... <laughs> hey, oh, oh, gosh. Get water all over my camera then. We have decided not to spend the night. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Me and Julius are about to go hang out with some friends in town. And uh, enjoy the rest of our night. It is... I don't know, 6 o'clock-ish, something like that. We're headed out. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys like these hunting vlogs, if you think I should take Julius on again, let me know, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.